An Earth citizen is someone who takes ownership of their own health, happiness, and peace, and trusts themselves to be able to overcome their current situation. Your brain has more power than what you might be believing right now. And I think it starts from there, first and foremost, because nobody teaches us this in school, that your brain has more potential and power than you believe. So imagine if you have everybody in this world, all almost 8 billion, almost 8 billion people who have this kind of spirit, who have this kind of thought, who have this kind of independence, who have this kind of self-love and self-trust in themselves and in their divine brain. Don't you think this world would be such a happier place, such a healthier place, such a more harmonious place? Hi guys, this is Linda from Brain Education TV. If this is your first time, Welcome! Please consider subscribing to our channel, like this video, and click the bell for notifications of each new episode. In this video, I'm going to talk about what is an Earth Citizen. So if you've been following my 10-minute routines that I put out every Saturday, you'll probably have noticed that I start the beginning of each video like this. Hello Earth Citizens! Hello Earth Citizens! Hello Earth Citizens! Hello Earth Citizens! So I've been calling you guys Earth Citizens this whole time, and maybe you're thinking, what the heck is an Earth Citizen? So I'm going to break it down for you in this video. Earth Citizens, first of all, is a term coined by the founder of Brain Education, Il Chili. It describes someone who takes care of their own health, happiness, and peace using the power of their brain. It comes from the idea that a person who knows how to take care of their own health, happiness, and peace using the power of their brain knows how to take care of other people and the earth also as well using the power of their brain. So ultimately, it's somebody who knows how to use the brain to create health, happiness, and peace for myself, for my family, for people around me, and ultimately for humanity and the earth. So why is this concept important for our 21st century world today? In our world, especially in this pandemic era, there's a lot of fear, a lot of mistrust, and a lot of anxiety surrounding our society right now. 2020 was a year of huge awakenings. It was a chance for us to see that these systems, these man-made systems that we put into place, such as politics, education, religion, these kinds of institutions that hold a lot of power and influence in our society, they weren't able to completely guarantee people's safety and well-being during this pandemic era. And I think that brought a lot of huge awakenings in me and also it opened a lot of eyes for people in society in general. These systems that we believed in so much uh, proved to be something that of course we can utilize but not 100% completely rely on. And the reason why I talk about this is, is because an Earth citizen is someone who takes ownership of their own health, happiness, and peace, and trusts themselves to be able to overcome their current situation. So many of us, we give our power to other people to fix our problems. If we're not feeling well, we take a pill, or if we're... Uh, lost about something, we ask somebody else to solve the problem for us. So many times, in little subtle ways, we rely on other people to fix our problems for us. Especially if it's like a physical health problem, we rely on other people more than we trust ourselves. I think that's a key point that I just mentioned there, that we trust others more than we trust ourselves. But an Earth citizen is someone who trusts themselves and knows how to use their brain well to create their own health, happiness, and peace. So the reason why we say hello Earth citizens is because on this channel we hope to give you guys some resources and let you know first and foremost that your brain has more power than what you might be believing right now. And I think it starts from there first and foremost because nobody teaches us this in school that your brain has more potential and power than you believe. Your brain has the perfect system to reverse any ailments that you might be feeling. Your brain has the perfect systems to overcome any emotional upsets that you might have. And your brain has the power to also break through any mental barriers that you might be creating right now. But when we're so drowned by our problems, it's very hard to even see or believe that our brain has this much power. And because we're in this state where we don't see it and believe that we have the power to change and overcome, even though 
it might sound like a good thing, but if you're right here, if you're stuck here, you don't believe that this is possible for you. But the first step comes from saying, no, I might be stuck in this state, but I have the power if I choose to slowly lift my hands away and open and see. And an earth citizen starts from there. Someone who says, wait a minute, do I really have to be stuck in this unfavorable state that I'm in? Whether it's a physical thing, whether it's an emotional thing or a mental thing, a spiritual thing, an earth citizen is someone who says, no, this can't be all there is to life. I have to find what is real. I have to find the real truth and the real answer. And that real truth and real answer lies within me. So I am going to build a relationship of self-love, self-trust, self-discovery to find the power within my brain for me to take ownership of my health, happiness, and peace because it is my responsibility to take care of these three things. It's not anybody else's responsibility to make me healthy, make me happy, or make me feel at peace. Because you might have wonderful people who give you health, who give you happiness, who give you peace, but ultimately, if you don't feel that on the inside, it does not matter what you have on the outside at all. So an earth citizen is someone who hears this message and says, yes, I totally understand. I totally feel you and I feel the same way. I feel like I have so much more power inside of me than I realized. And I believe that I 100% have the ability to overcome any hardships that I'm feeling right now. So once you say, yes, I totally believe it and I totally am with you, then you take the steps, the action to make that into your reality. What do you think that person will do next? Do you think a person who really believes their brain power will say, okay, I believe it, but let me just go to my doctor and let me go to my other people to fix my problems. Or do you think a person who really trusts that they have the power to fix their problems will then act and find ways to solve their problems on their own, taking ownership of their health in their own hands. Of course, it's the latter. So I'm not saying that you should never listen to a doctor. That is not what I'm saying at all. So please don't get my message wrong. There's a fine line between using experts for help and relying on experts to fix you. Do you understand the difference? There's a huge difference. I'm all for using experts to help you because they have more expertise, more knowledge in certain areas than you do. Please, by all means, receive help from experts when you need it, but do not rely on experts to fix you. And tur by turning your brain off and saying, I don't know what to do, you just fix me and I'm just gonna go on autopilot and just do whatever you say. This is what I'm saying an earth citizen does not do. So imagine if you have everybody in this world, all almost 8 billion, almost 8 billion people who have this kind of spirit, who have this kind of thought, who have this kind of independence, who have this kind of self-love and self-trust in themselves and in their divine brain, in their brain that holds so many of potentials and so many secrets and so many things that we don't know yet. Imagine 8 billion people who live that way. Don't you think this world would be such a happier place, such a healthier place, such a more harmonious place? Because if we have people who know how to fix their own problems, then these, these people, through their own experience, can help others with their issues as well. So then we create a society where everybody knows how to take ownership, take responsibility, and resolve their own issues, and also be in a place where they can help others as well. So then with this spirit, with this mentality of earth citizenship, you create a whole society of healers. This world desperately needs more healers, more lovers, more um, people who can bring nurturing energy into the world. And I believe that an earth citizen with that kind of spirit and belief in themselves to take ownership of their health, happiness, and peace can make that a reality. So I hope everybody watching this video and everybody on this channel can agree with this mission and philosophy of earth citizens. And I hope that you can join me, Gabby, and other people to create a world of health, happiness, and peace for everybody. So I would love to hear your thoughts about what I just shared about earth citizenship. So 
please leave your comments down below and I would love to read them and see what you have to say. And also if you agree with this Earth Citizen Spirit, please comment below. I am an Earth Citizen and join the gang to help create health, happiness, and peace for myself, for my family, my community, and humanity. Thanks for tuning in everyone. As always, I love you all. Thank you so much. Bye.